viewers, uh, welcome back to my let's play of uh, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order Part 2. Now, uh, last you were with me, I was in a bit of a mess with this place here. Um, I figured that out now. I wasn't really, it's kind of partly my, my fault, I wasn't really reading it right. Um, um, what what you were ha what you had to do to get rid of them all and stop this never-ending stream of them, you know, you stormtroopers. You just you basically had to read the the prompt up on screen. Uh, I was kind of ignoring that prompt because I'd already seen it, done it, whatever, you know, and uh, I was just taking it as well. It's just it's just repeating itself, you know. Um, I just kind of ignored that prompt, and I just wasn't. You had to basically do what it says on that prompt to get to another stage, and it came up with another prompt after that. So the first prompt, I, the first prompt I came up with was, I've done it now. But it, the first prompt was block, block your attacks with your lightsaber. I did that. And I did that. You had to do that a few times before it went away, and then it came up with another prompt saying um, parry, parry your attacks. Um, which again is the same kind of button, R1, well L1, sorry, L1, same button. Uh, so I did that. Um, to give us the game that I'd done it, you know, and came up with another prompt. Um, and that's the prompt you see now, which is use a force on an object with a, a blue outline. So the blue outline, as you can see, is the wheel. So, uh, so now we've got to use that to stop the wheel, use the force to stop the wheel. So uh, yeah, that's that's how it works, you know. I thought it was just, I thought it was a glitch, and it was a never-ending stream of these things, and you know, uh, these uh, stormtroopers. But you know, this is how you do it. You have to read these prompts. It's just kind of going. It's kind of in tutorial uh, mode at the moment. I think it's still in tutorial mode, and you have to kind of follow prompts, or it won't go forward. Um, and that's what it did. Um, so yeah, let's carry on. So now we have to use force on objects with a blue outline, which of course is that real thing. So let's do that. Climb. Yep. Ah, not quick enough. Climbing there. Okay. Forward. Messed up here last time we came up here. Block here. My party. Yeah. Okay. The fugitive comes this way. I'm ready for it. Uh, what did I do here? Jedi. Yeah. So oh, that's that. But now we're into new territory. Whoa! I was just about to never say. I was about to see what a new territory and then does that. Just fall off the edge. Hold on. Uh, easy enough done. So, yeah, I'm going to park for you. I was a while out in between this, this video and the last one, I was having a wee uh, look online to see where this fits in the, 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 in the Star Wars timeline. You know, Star Wars timeline, timeline of the, the whole Star Wars universe, you know? Uh, this was actually set between episode 3, five years after, well, five years after episode 3, and 15 years, roughly 15 before the events of episode 4. So yeah, um, that's where it all fits, so... So this time we've got Darth Vader roaming roaming around somewhere and you know. Luke Skywalker's just a five-year-old boy. He's not kinda in the picture yet, you know, he won't appear I don't think. But uh yeah, we could get Darth Vader, we could get anybody like that, I don't know. Hearth. 
could get Han Solo even, or I don't know. And he was, he's a bit older than Luke, so he could have been quite young at his age at this sort of time. Child age. So. Uh, of course, Chewbacca, kind of old already. <laughs> How did I get up here? Uh, uh, how did I get up there? I don't know. What am I missing here? That's on, on some weird language, like Chinese or something. What the hell language is that? <laughs> it's like putties, I would guess, or something weird. How do you get up? How do you grab hold? Is that what the hell? Uh, how do you get up? How do you go? Up? Go around. Yeah, go around. Is it? Here? Uh, up the grating? Uh, told you, but I'm actually uh, I'm playing on the PC with a PS4 controller. So yeah, I'm actually, strangely, I had to have a bit of software. The last time I played anything with a PS4 controller on the PC, I had to get software to make it work. But uh, I haven't needed that on, the, on this game. Just plug in, plug in, and it's uh, it's working already without any software needed. Get to the front, stop the train. To move in between bursts. Yeah. Yeah, already, already know that. Uh, Faster! He's here. I'm ready for him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the vehicle. Let me go. Come on, sir. What? He shot the coupling out. Gotta get down. Down. 
Folk in there, it's a bit like it there. <laughs> a brief glimpse of that ship and it looked Millennium Falcon esque. so low. Oh, this is stupid. This really this is darling silly, this respawn rubbish. Bring back autosave. This is stupid. Running out of lives. Uh, you go f so far back, it's ridiculous. It really is. Well, maybe not so far like the last time, but la the first time I did it, God, I just went far, far back. It's just punishing. Uh... Where am I going to be here? <laughs> it's just horrible. You go horrible distances back. It's just... It's just not good. Uh, that's not so bad. That's, oh, that's not, that wasn't so bad. Nice. No, how far back is that? Is that just where it was? Far right back. Right. The train stopped.
this can't be good. Whoa! See, uh, I recognize that stance. Perhaps you've had some training after all. Who's your master? Padawan? Yeah, Someone I killed, perhaps? What Jedi gave their life so that you might live? Oh, I've got no hope here. Quickly recover after being knocked down. Circle. Okay. Very well. You won't dodge the next. This is hopeless. I've got no hope of against a Sith. A Sith Pro. Whatever you like to call him. Sith Master. Whatever. This is kind of... Bad of one against a Sith Lord. No hope. Better than I No. I'm taking some health out of her. But, uh... I will destroy you. Uh, what's this? Evade the attack. Red attacks are unblockable. Uh, I don't know. Is that our health there? Second sister. have uh, opened that, closed that a bit sooner, I think. Uh, what the hell is that? <laughs> Weird looking ship. <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> I think I've seen that in any Star Wars movie or game. some seat. Thanks for the help. But who are you people? My name is Seer Junda, and this is my captain, Grease Dritus. How you doing? Yeah, the Manus is my ship, but you better pay attention to this lady here. So, who are you? Cal. Kestis. Who was that back there? Imperial Inquisitor. She's a Force user hunting Jedi survivors. And now that she knows who you are, she will not stop until she destroys you. How do you know so much? And why'd you help me? We track Imperial communications. We heard the Inquisitors were heading to Brock. So we made our move. Oh, yeah? And what's the bounty on Jedi these days, anyway? That's gratitude for you. Look, I get it. You've been surviving on your own for so long that it's impossible to trust anyone. And it's what's kept you alive. But this is about something bigger than just surviving. 
Like what? Like rebuilding the Jedi Order. You too? Anybody else? Oh, we're not good enough for you? The Jedi Council? They're gone. Captain, set a course for Bagano. Aye, aye. Hmm. In the meantime, try and relax. Go, you're safe. She's got uh, Han Solo's yeah. kind of costume on there. Very Han Solo kind of costume she's got there. Certainly can't be related. <laughs> Find your destiny. Calico! You were talking in your sleep. Weirdo. Uh, uh, <laughs> coming from something that looks like uh, some sort of clown mixed with a teddy bear or something. Uh. Um, Grease? Not now, I got work to do. Uh, to do that. Uh, <laughs> nothing to do. I can't interact with that chair, uh, even that told me to. And. Something I can interact with, or hmm. you left there? Is it? Uh, yeah. I haven't got a Scooby. What I do next here? Just got to wait for time to pass here or something. Because nothing's happening. Can't interact with anything. I'm just not looking in the right place for interaction.
quite nice, quite nice sound. That song, I wrote it years ago. You touch an object and witness events connected to it. You feel its history. It's an echo in the force from the object. Not many Jedi have that skill. How would you know that? I was once a Jedi, but not anymore. Do I know you? No, but I knew your master, Jaro DePaul. He was a true guardian of the Republic. He was a hero. Listen, something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but my connection to the Force is damaged. When I meditate, if I let my guard down, I lose control. And it's like I'm back in that moment when... You survived, Cal. And you're not alone. Not anymore. We'll come up on our destination. Bagana. A Jedi I knew discovered it before the Purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire doesn't know this place exists? No. So, what's the plan? We hide out here? We're done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know you don't trust me. And I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy. And a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But, until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. May the Force be with you. Guess I'm looking for a Jedi then. Skill point. There's required. already one here. Mm. Why does Seer need me? My first skill point. Hmm. What do I do with skill points? Let's see. All right. Abilities customization. Uh, that's, that wasn't there before. Ooh, I've got a new uniform now. Uh. I kind of like the last one, I like the cape, or whatever it is, that sort of uh, poncho thing. Um, put the poncho back on. Yeah, kind of like that. The Braca Scrapper. Jacket. It's not a jacket. I don't know what that is, it's just like a... Body warmer, top or something. I don't know what it is. Or a jacket. That's more like a jacket. But it's a kind of poncho. Right. Uh, right. Anything else? No. Kind of blows about in the wind a bit, but yeah, kind of cool. Who am I going to see? Am I going to see someone from Star Wars films here? <laughs> I wish. Could only be, well, Han Solo or someone kind of of that age or say we're up to before episode 4, so 15 years before that film, so um, it could only be Yoda or um, Oh. Um. 
yeah, it's kind of like, it's a bit like, um, Outcast or something like that, and it's a bit like, it's a bit like, uh, you know, it's kind of what I expected it to be, actually, this game, so far. It's kind of what I was hoping it to be, which is, you know, kind of like Outcast, it's kind of like, uh, you know, Knights of the Old Republic. Um, yeah. a safe place to meditate. Just need to focus my mind. Meditate? Yeah. All three. Okay. What the hell is this? Save point. Okay. Save points are located throughout Carl's journey. Make sure to interact with them to save your progress. Okay. Save points are where Carl can rest and spend skill points to acquire new skills. Okay, right, let's get a, let's spend that skill point again. Uh, you have enough skill points to learn new skills. Open the skill tree to use them. Okay, um, X. Okay, uh, spend your skill points to learn overhead slash. Okay, looks like I've got no choice but that. Uh, nothing else. It's the first of quite a, me quite a few. I can only go other ways when I get the second skill point. Uh, okay. Okay. Hold it down. Okay. So that's just an overhead. I've not had that already. I've not been able to do that already. I could have sworn I, I did that already with uh, some stormtroopers. Uh, hmm. Yeah. Uh, dash strike. Carl hmm, dashes forward and attacks his target. Jump while dashing to flip over the target instead. Uh, I haven't got any more skill points though, so I won't be able to... Ooh, nice. Uh -oh. What's this one? I don't bother. Hmm, gonna... Okay. What's over there? Okay, we'll, we'll deal with that later. Uh, rest? Nah. Uh, circle leave. Okay. Hmm. Hey, BD1. I'm Cal. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just I'm looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi, I think. Hold on. You know the Jedi? What do you know? Wait, hold on! <laughs> you just slice that? Thanks. Some weird looking robotic chicken. Or something. I don't know. Uh, where have I... Did I come from there? I can't remember where I came from there. I think it was here, yeah. Okay. So we've got a chicken droid or something, I don't know what it is, but uh how it how it's appeared out of nowhere I don't know. Some somebody must own it. person I've got to meet, I guess. Um, 
Come on. Can I get up there? Uh, come on, how can I get up there? How can I get up? I guess if you had subtitles or you'd be able to kind of, you know, know what was said there when the chicken droid kind of um, spoke. I mean, Carl understood it, but uh, obviously he didn't. <laughs> I can't speak that language and uh, yeah, no subtitles up, but oh well. I don't really want subtitles up. Uh, other. I had to go through six movies without knowing really what uh, R2-D2 said or... So, you know, um... So, I can bear it. <clears throat> How do you get up? I don't get it. I can't get up. I won't grab. Not being L2. Oh, wait, I'm not pressing the right button. L2. <laughs> I was pressing the wrong button. I was pressing square for for some reason. Okay. Uh, hello, chicken thing. That's the vault seer mentioned. <laughs> Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. Uh, what's this? New objective added to. Well, it reached the vault. Okay. Uh, so I've got a map now, 3D map. Uh, okay. Cool. The ship. And that is where I've come so far. So, save points are just double circles. Move, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's that? Rotate. Yeah. It's just your analog sticks. Uh, zoom is L. Okay. L2 and R2. For zooming. Nice. Okay, unexplored path. Unexplored path. Um, fractured plane. Twenty-eight percent explored. Zero to two chess. So that's the landing pad. Zero to one. Hold on. Zero to one secret. I'll have to. I'll have to go back. There's a secret. In this area here, beside the landing pad. Uh, chest there too, where I am. But that, that could be further forward. Uh, yeah, fractured plane is further forward as well. But this is only 25% explored. Uh, and I've got one secret to get. Uh, in the landing pad. So let's go back. See if you can get my secret. Um, can I go back down? to kind of highlight or something, you know? Get that kind of kind of weird vision or something, kind of thermal vision or whatever. <laughs> I don't know, just power, you know, kind of a force kind of thing where you could 
kind of make things highlight and whatnot. It doesn't seem to have it. Uh, get through no use your force power on a blue bordered one but that's red so I don't know obviously the red must mean out of bounds or just can't get through or just not ready to get through yet I would reckon uh, no I can't get through uh, something I'll probably I'll probably be back here and be able to come back and uh Right, map. Let's see. Is this eighty to one? What? B D one is busy. Who's B D one? That must be that f whatever that thing was, that furry thing. Looks like a squirrel or something. Uh Ah. Right. So that's my secret area. Though not really because I can't get through to the other bit of it. Uh what is this? BD1 is busy. What the hell does that mean? That must be that. I can't get my map for some reason. Uh, I don't, what is that? <laughs> what, is, what is BD1? Uh, who is BD1? Uh, that's, that's ridiculous. I don't know what's meaning there. Now let's save it again. Map anymore. Why not? Hold on. Hollow lamp. Oh, it's that thing. <laughs> it's on my back. What the hell is that? Opens the the hollow. That's a hollow map. So BD1 can right. 
map to the other places. Okay, BD1. So that thing's BD1. Uh, stim canisters. BD1. Okay. So that's replenishment. So I've got a. Um, my heel button is the up on the uh, the D pad. I remember that. Before I started playing this game, okay now. Yeah, um. No working. Uh, still, yeah, it's still busy. But it gave me the map when he was away. And I was here and he was away at this point, so I don't know why it's not giving me the map anymore. Are. Go along there. I don't know because what's that? What is that over there? Let's go over here. Ooh, lizard thing. It's an iguana or something. I sent something over here. Hmm. Ah, oh, come on, BD1, where are you? I want my map. BD1, what are you doing? How do you... Am I missing the... Am I missing the, um... Yeah, there's things down there, but... Okay, let's go. That's a really big bug. <laughs> easy to kill as well. <laughs> Chop them in half. After boggling eggs in the pack fought back. Yeah. Uh, through a rare ability known as psychometry, Cal can receive information from the force when he I didn't get to read it all. Uh No way through here. I guess that's why BD1 warned me. All right, maybe I'll listen to you next time. How's it? Oh, we didn't. We didn't. He obviously got told his name, and we got that. Yeah, no subtitle, but <laughs> when they first met. Uh, across here. Can I get across there? It's a bit risky. Right, I'm gonna have to it's a bit risky, I don't know if I'll make it. Uh, uh no, damn it. 
too far. What the hell's that? A little buggy thing. That same thing I had to kill up there. Uh, Any ideas? Gotta get across this gap somehow. A zip line? Uh, uh have to, to interrupt this thing. Can't. Hmm. Door over there. Uh don't know how to get to it though. The hell. Did you hear? I can't interrupt this thing. <laughs> uh Oh, it's a zip line. It's a zip line, okay. Whoa. How'd you know that would work? Wait, you didn't? I hear you, but there's something over here I want to explore. Mm. I can't get a map anymore. This is really annoying. I want a map. Uh, boggling studies. Boggling, boggling studies. One out. Is this a dead... Hmm... Dead flocks killed by boglings when it attempted to raid their nest. So that must have been the big fat thing and buggy things were the... Yeah, the, the flocks is the fat thing and the... The boglings are... Uh, the insect things. Okay. Uh, Morgano. That's the planet we're on. Uh, I'm pressing that. That is the big button on the PS PS4 controller, but I can't, it's just not giving me it. That is supposed to be the map, and it just keeps saying he's busy. What's he busy doing? He's just, uh, he's right next to doing nothing, the thing, so I don't know why he's busy. Uh, uh, do I have to go down there? I don't know, I'll go over there. through there, that's for sure, unless I use my... Yeah, use that. Hi. Slow mo, what's over, what's over here? Let's see. Uh, what the hell? There's a way through there as well. Hold to illuminate with your lightsaber. can get through. Can I? Oh yeah, I can. Right. Uh-uh. Oh -uh. no! <laughs> 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 Damn it, I can't eat. What the hell? Restore. When you die, you lose all your XP gains since your last skill point. Restore. Damaging the enemy who killed you will restore your lost XP and refill your life and force to at their maximum. Um... Oh, well, I'm dead. Uh, 
back here. Oh no, I'm way back there. That was bad. Yeah, this is punishing. Really punishing on the... This lives thing shouldn't really be a, a thing you do. I don't know, it's just not good. It's, it is getting a bit dated, there's no doubt about it. Uh, you're used to games with autosave now. Or manual save. But not infinite lives. It's kind of looking a bit dated now. Um, Remembered what I've done here though. Picked it up. So it remembers pickups and whatnot, but it doesn't remember all the sort of things on the way to it. Yeah. Okay. You're not busy, it's just not busy at all, it's just standing there. Uh, that's nonsense. It's standing there doing nothing. Uh, and following you around. Uh, I want a map! Why can't I get a map? There's no reason for that, it's not busy. is locked from Just the other it. side. Oh no. Stops. Out the road. Uh, where's this going? Careful over there. That doesn't look safe. Just like back at the scrapyard. Right. Drop down the circle. Ooh. Shimmy. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I'm coming. Oh. The hell? These are fairly easy to kill as well. Um. Okay, I think that's about my our rock so Kind of stop here. Seems a good place to, to stop. And I'll. Um. Hmm. Okay. This is to go here. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Thanks for watching. Uh. That's that was part two. So hope you can join me for part three. So yeah. See you later. Um. I don't know how the... How do you get out of the recording? Hold on. Right, um, yeah. Um... The shadow play's way of doing this is weird. You've got, you've got a alt Z and I don't know what the... There you go. Um... Yeah, uh... Hope you can come back um, for part three. See you then. Bye.